Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to get cellular data on your iPod Touch. So the first step is you need to make sure you have a compatible iPod Touch. So uh, you just want to check the right hand side here. And if you have a hole on the right hand side of your iPod Touch, that means you're good to go. Why is this important? Because you need a cellular iPod Touch in order for you to use a cellular network connection. Because what you want to do is you're going to need to get a SIM ejector and you're going to have to eject the uh, SIM card slot. You just insert the SIM ejector into the hole, uh, not in that way, and you just eject the SIM card and then you put a SIM with cellular data and you insert it into your iPod Touch. Once you've done that, it's kind of plug and play. However, if it isn't, you will need to go to settings. And then under Bluetooth here, if you have inserted the SIM card, you're going to see mobile data. You just tap on the mobile data and just like that, you just turn it on and you have cellular data on your iPod Touch. If you don't have an iPod Touch model uh, with you know, the SIM card tray, of course, you can't insert the SIM card. Therefore, you can't access the cellular data. The best bet is you get another device, you know, a cheap phone or even a portable hotspot. And, you know, with a cheap phone, you set up tethering so that you can hotspot uh, to your iPod Touch. So that means you have internet wherever you go. If you buy a personal hotspot, like a portable one, well, then the same deal. You just turn that on and then you have a Wi-Fi network wherever you go using the cellular network. So that's all there is to it. Hopefully this video did help you. If it did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're brand new. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye bye.